Justin, Jeremy Humphreys bonded out of jail two days after he was arrested, and he says he never should have been there. Jeremy Humphreys has lived in this spot for three decades. He says Friday morning he heard a loud four-wheeler in his yard, and he wasn't sure who it was. So I went out to where the mailbox is at. I've been having to carry the gun for the last couple of weeks because of the dogs. He then spotted his neighbor's dog. And he started growling, snarling, slobbering. Next thing you know, here they all come. He says his neighbor's dog started to run at him, and he reacted. They were trying to make me out as a boogeyman. I did it because they were coming, they were going to kill me. Humphrey says he shot this dog, a chocolate lab named Maximus that he claims was vicious. His neighbors live just across the yard and run an animal rescue service. Humphrey says he didn't want to shoot the dog, but he felt like he had no choice. The dog's owner, Kaylee Dollison, says Maximus had a calm temperament and wouldn't have attacked anyone. My six-year-old wrestles with him. He lays right in bed or on the couch with my newborn. He's probably one of the sweetest dogs that I've had. And she says now her kids miss him. They become their brothers and sisters, and it's hard to explain to a four-year-old why a dog is never coming back inside. The Humphreys family and the Dollisons family haven't spoken since the incident. Reporting in the Longview Bureau, I'm Kevin Boyce, CBS 19 News.